been wanting to do this video for such a long time and it's a comparison of all the Chanel flat bags I have. So now I have two Chanel Classic Flaps and one Chanel Easy Flap and I'm just going to do a comparison because I guess they're kind of similar but kind of different at the same time. I'm going to do a comparison for you guys in case you guys are on the verge of buying one of them and you guys don't know which one you want to get. So let's get started. So here I have my trusty measuring tape so that I can do the measurements on camera so you guys can know how big or small they are. So first I'm going to do my vintage Chanel Classic Flap, black with gold hardware and this is in lambskin. I got this from Yugi's Closet for my 21st, oh 22nd birthday. First the width of it, it's like a little more than 10 inches give or take. So as you can see here a little more than 10 inches and the height of it. The height is like honestly 6.5 inches as you guys can see over here give or take because as you guys can see it's kind of like triangular so it's kind of hard to measure it straight and how deep it is it is it's also around like 2.5 inches a little smaller and I guess these are all the measurements I can think of overall I feel like this is a really classy and also versatile bag you can put whatever card you use the most over here so maybe like driver's license or a metro card all that and inside here you can also put like your passport here when you're traveling in this slot so you can just open up one flap and this is the double flap so there's another layer to it and I never ever use this button I don't know why it's even here because I don't know I just never use it and you can also put things over here in this little pocket over here and then we have the main pocket which is right here and here's the famous little pocket for your lipstick or love letter and two little pockets for like napkins or whatever and inside is this beautiful burgundy red color so this is my vintage lambskin classic flap my newest purchase which is this also black with gold hardware in caviar leather and also Chanel classic flap so let me do a measurement first so the width of it is like 10 oh this one's larger 10.25 inches sort of give or take like this and then also height of it is like a little more than six inches 6.5 I want to say 6.5 inches and then how deep it is 2.5 inches the bottom of it and the top of it if you want to know top is like 1.5 inches and then is there anything else I haven't measured I guess also the bottom of it top and bottom okay bottom of it is like yeah a little I want to say it's like 10 inches honestly so it's like this yeah 10 inches so here are the two bags side by side overlap each other. Yeah, I do feel like the vintage one is slightly smaller as you can't really see on camera, but I don't know. Is it just the leather shrinking? This is their bottoms. I feel like the lambskin one does look more narrow. The base looks more narrow, but it could be the leather just being less puffy. And this is the, yes, side by side. And also the back of the two bags. And then the inside. One difference that I can see right away is that the newer classic lab, the caviar one has a zipper pocket over here, but the lambskin one does not. And same thing, you can put your passport whatever over here, and also you can put your, I guess, bag strap inside. And this is also a beautiful burgundy color right here. And this zipper, I'm not sure, I guess you can fit like, I don't know, very tiny lipsticks. I don't even know, but that's gonna make this really puffy. I don't know what you can put inside, maybe it's just a decoration. I honestly don't know what you can put inside here. So beautiful burgundy color inside and also the famous, I guess, the lipstick compartment over here. And this bag's brand new, I haven't used it yet. I haven't found the time to use it and I'm in the middle of moving, so. Honestly, a lot of things I kind of don't want to open them up so I can keep them nicely packed for the move. And also another pocket over here. And this also has the little button that I'm pretty sure I will never ever use. And so let me do a try on for the two bags. So this is my Chanel Classic Flap, black with gold hardware, caviar leather, and I can also do it like, so this is like the more elegant way of wearing it. And this is the vintage Chanel Classic Flap. I feel like this sits a little longer than the caviar one. And I can also do it like this. So let's measure the strap length. 
So when it's double from the top of my shoulder to here, the strap drop looks like it's around like 11, 11 inches. And then when I do the full length, looks like it's about 18 inches. And then same thing with the modern one, also around 18 inches. And then this is about 10.5 inches. The two bags both hung with bull straps. Yeah, it does look like the vintage one is slightly longer, just by a tiny bit. And then, so let me just measure from one end to the other. This is 16 inches, a little more than 16, like maybe 16.25. This is the caviar, and the vintage one is like 16.5 so slightly slightly longer and the third bag that I'm going to show you guys is the easy flap and I have it in beige and silver hardware so it's like a much younger looking bag I wear this to death I love this bag so much and I also love how the shoulder strap has this special I guess leather section to it so it doesn't hurt your shoulders as much so this is much longer this rests on my hip and then also double strap it looks like this and so let's do the measurement with double strapped on my shoulder the drop is around 13.5 and then when I do the single strap the drop is around 21 so quite long and when I hang it like this and measure the drop it's like 19.5 ish and when I say ish is because it's not exactly in the middle but around 19 yeah it's more like 19 and then two straps it's like 10.5 let me do a comparison of the classic flap and also the easy flap so the easy flap honestly <laughs> When you look at it from afar, it looks very, very, very similar. I want to say though, the Easy Flap is much softer. Not just because I use it for a longer time, it is softer to begin with. And the Classic Flap is much more structured. The base is pretty stiff. Also, same with the Vintage one, the base is really stiff. But for the Easy Flap, the base is soft, so you can squish it. And it does look, I guess, less structured and slouchier, hence the name Easy Flap. And let's get a closer look. So when I open it, there's a zipper inside. So this is the biggest difference. This is a zipper whereas for the classic flaps, for the double flaps, there's a, another layer of flap to it. And also a little section over here for a password or phone. It's really, really handy, a little pocket. And inside it looks like this. There's a zipper in here, which is something that the classic flaps don't have. There's a pocket for your phone, which is something that the classic flaps don't have. And you can also put like, I guess, your pocket tissue over here. And there's this whole big section for, let me just clear this, for anything you want. And this bag is just much more flexible and to me easier to use much more relaxed much more casual I want to say this is a really practical bag from my knowledge I think they already discontinued it so you can't really buy this brand new anymore but I'm pretty sure you can find some in the pre-love market so here is a last comparison of the three bags please let me know if I missed on I guess any of the aspects I can do another video or Q&A of these bags so I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do please give a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this and I would love to see you guys next time bye